A consolidation plan that would save the state $8 million has hit a roadblock. A legislative committee has passed a bill to block the reorganization plan by the Department of Human Services. DHS wants to streamline the processing for getting food stamps and Medicaid by using phone and online registration. But the plan calls for about 200 layoffs. What Department of Human Services wanted to do with the original uh, plan, reorganization plan, was to close every single public assistance office in the state. That equates to 31 locations statewide and 50 welfare units. That's just too much. That is basically, in my opinion, closing the Department of Human Services. The bill under consideration would allow a consolidation plan after public hearings and opportunities for unions to file grievances. The bill moves on to the full floors on Wednesday. Lawmakers also advanced a bill that would increase the per barrel oil tax from five cents to one dollar and five cents. The hike would raise an extra twenty two million dollars a year. A local environmental group says the tax translates to about a two percent or two cent increase in gas as well as a small hike in electricity rates. And smokers would pay one cent more per cigarette starting in July under an agreement reached by Hawaii lawmakers today. The new hike would raise an estimated ten million a year. The possibility of President